Welcome to another episode of Barman Saturdays, and this week I decided to take a look at the short film, The Tale of Tilly's Dragon. And I say short film because this film is about 44 minutes long, so basically an hour-long special, you know, for a kid's show, you know. So it does fit into that time slot pretty solidly. So yeah, this is not a feature-length film by any stretch of the imagination, though it did win an award for that, which is kind of weird. <laughs> But for the film itself, well, this is a film definitely aimed at a younger demographic. Definitely a lot younger than myself, because it's just really cute and innocent and just wants to teach some basic, simple lessons about how you shouldn't judge a book by its cover and all that jazz, you know. Nothing too complicated, just your usual life lessons about the importance of listening to others and not just talking all the time. Those sorts of things. So, yeah, this is a film, you know, where it's like, you need to... To discuss this with your parents afterwards, and we even provided, you know, questions on the back to help you with it. So, you know, despite being, you know, 44 minutes long, they still got, you know, four questions they managed to put on here. Probably could fit some more if they wanted to, I'm sure. But they'd have to give up some space for the credits or whatnot, or um, make the writing even smaller, so it's even harder to read. At least from afar. Oh, look at the cute innocent scene in the bath. Uh, but yeah, there's just not much I can really say negative about the Tale of Tilly's Dragon, because it's animated fairly well, which is probably to be expected, because apparently, according to Wikipedia, a lot of um, the technical staff was former Disney employees. So, yeah, and there's a lot of um, quality voice acting talent associated with the film as well, because the two main characters are um, voice people that have been rather prolific in their careers, so... There's just a lot of experienced staff when we came to this project. It might be a 44-minute movie, but it does fairly well for the target audience, I'm sure. For those outside the target audience, though, you're probably going to be bored or annoyed by just how cutesy it is, you know? So, not something I'd say you should watch if you're um, my age. So, yeah, something you should just buy and put in front of your um, young kids. You know, if you want to discuss some of the basic life lessons out there. Till next time, then. See ya. No. You're so funny. Come on, let's get you dried off.